guys, it's Rose with Rose Likes Crochet. How is everybody doing? It is Tuesday, October 19th, 2021. And as you can see from the title, this is going to be, um, I don't know how many of how many, but I have an update on the ornaments that we're collecting for Crystal at Bago Day. So for those of you who are new here, my name is Rose, I like to crochet. I like yarn a lot and I make stitch markers. So go check out my Etsy shop. I just did an update a couple days ago and there's still lots and lots of stitch markers left. So I live in the Chicago area. I have one daughter and I have a bunch of animals. So we call this place the zoo. And my daughter's nickname is carrots, like the vegetable. So anyway, um, there was um, someone, one of my subscribers, who's also a subscriber to Crystal at Bag o Day, and I will link her channel down below in the description box. And she had an idea that she wanted to send Crystal a Christmas ornament. So I talked to Crystal about it and she was okay with people sending the ornaments to me. I would show them on video and then I would ship her the whole box. Um, and the reason we're doing this is Crystal just bought a new house and she's going to have a 12 foot Christmas tree. So she was excited to have ornaments from all of you guys to fill up her Christmas tree. So the original video where I explain everything is video number 242. So if you want to go and check that out, it's basically just send one Christmas ornament per person and it can, just has to be handmade however you want to make it. It doesn't have to be crocheted. It can be how, however you want to do it. And if you want to send it to me, I will probably do one more update. Um, I am asking for if you want to send them to send them by November. November 1st so I can get them to Crystal so she can get them on her Christmas tree. Um, so the past couple, like in the past month, I've been doing wings update videos and a lot of people have put in ornaments in their packages for wings. Wings is a domestic violence organization based here in Chicago and we're collecting um, items for them. So anyway, I did want to re-show some of the ornaments that came in the packages with the wings um, because some people don't watch those wings videos. And then I have a whole box of other ornaments <laughs> to um, open up and show you guys. So we're just going to start with the, the ornaments that came in the packages for wings. And I'm probably going to need glasses for this. So <laughs> let's get started, okay? So there's quite a few that we have already shown on wings videos but I'll show you here again too. Okay, so this one right here is an ornament that was sent in from Erica and she is from Wisconsin. And I will show you guys the ornaments. So that one is from Erica, it's a snow globe. So thank you so much Erica for sending that ornament for Crystal, I'm sure she's gonna love it. And then the next one is from Leilani and she is from Texas. And she sent that ornament right there. So there you go. All right, and then we have one in a baggie. And let me get it out. So this one is from Lynn, and Lynn is from Washington State. So it, it looks like a bell. So thank you so much, Lynn, for that. Okay, the next one comes from Becky, and Becky sent that card, and she sent this little heart ornament. And Becky is from Pennsylvania, so that one's going to go to Crystal. The next one comes from Janet, and uh, she writes in the card, I hope you enjoy your Christmas, and I hope you like the ornament I made for you and your family. And there was the card she sent for Crystal, and there is the ornament. Oh, that's beautiful. I love that. The next one comes from Dana, and Dana is from Texas, and she has a sealed envelope for Crystal, so I'm not gonna open that up, but she has this beautiful angel ornament, and that's from Dana for Crystal. The next one was an anonymous person. They did leave a message that said you could read the paper on the inside for the ornament, and there is the ornament, and it says, it is by Crochet Candy Crochet with me, Anita Louise Crochet Channel. So the next ornaments come from Chris J. And look at how beautiful that is. So she sent that one and that one. Oh my goodness, how adorable are those? So the next one comes from Diana, and Diana is from Michigan, and she sent this beautiful bauble here. Oh my gosh, I love that, that's gorgeous. 
Now these came from Petra or Petra from California and she actually said one of them was for me but I don't do a Christmas tree so we are going to give both of these to Crystal. So she crocheted around a ball. Look at both of them, they're beautiful. I love those. This next one comes from Judy and Judy is from Virginia and she sent this adorable little wreath for Crystal. Awesome. So the next one comes from Camilla and she wrote on the tag, Hi Crystal, I hope you and the Bod family like Philip the Frog. <laughs> Happy to be a part of your Christmas. Sincerely from Camilla. Camilla. And she, so if you guys ever watch Crystal in her new house, she has a visitor on her windowsill nightly and they named him Philip. He's a little frog. So this is the ornament. <laughs> she even put Philip on there. That's so cute. And that one came in a little Christmas bag too. The next ornament, oh my gosh, is so adorable. So this is the ornament. It's got two yarn balls in there and snow and snowflakes on the outside. And um, the note on there says, Dear Crystal, love your videos and very detailed directions in following along to crochet the beautiful items, especially the beanies. From Rosalie, a loyal viewer in Pennsylvania. Oh, there's a little um, measuring tape in there too. I don't know if you guys can see it. So cute. Okay, and the last one that I got that actually came in a box that was um, with Wings donations, What it uh, actually came in this big box right here, Merry Christmas box, and the car, it's from Joan, and the card writes, um, I truly wish I was able to crochet hundreds of them, but just being a part of helping you with filling your Christmas tree brings me joy. You are a blessing to so many with all you do, sincerely, Joan. And um, she said, Crystal can also use this to store some of her ornaments ornaments too. So this is the beautiful snowflake that Joan sent for Crystal. It's gorgeous. Okay, so those are all of the ornaments that came in Wings packages. So the other ones that I'm going to show you now are ones that came separately, not with a Wings donation. So there is um, quite a, there are quite a few envelopes and then there's a couple of boxes too. So here we're going to go with the first box. The first box comes from Barb, and Barb is from Illinois. And, <laughs> okay, so there's an envelope for Crystal, and it's sealed, so I'm gonna leave that in there sealed. <laughs> and this is the ornament. Oh my gosh, how cute is that? <gasps> that is so adorable. And then there is a note for me in here, so I'm gonna open this note up and see what it says. Okay, so the letter to me says, Hi Rose, in your video for Christmas ornaments for Crystal, you talked about her being an angel in disguise. So of course I had to make an angel in disguise for her. Oh my gosh, which explains the little cute face. She says, I have learned so much from watching her tutorials and so much more about yarn. Of course, I love seeing her new home and all the decorating she is doing. Thank you, Rose, for doing this for Crystal and to the lady who suggested it to you. I'm looking forward to seeing all the ornaments and, of course, the tree. Merry Christmas a tad early. Love, Barb. P.S. Rose, I love what you are doing for wings. Ah, thanks so much, Barb. I will make sure that Crystal gets your little um, angel in disguise here. That's awesome. Okay, and then the next box actually said on there, um, Bod Ornament. Okay, so this box is from Joy, and Joy is from Ohio, and there is a card for Crystal, which is right here. So there's the card for Crystal, and she also has a letter in here, so I guess I should probably read the letter. Dear Rose, yes, you may show my gifts. I am sending you a gift as well. It is the one in the purple tissue paper, a little yarny friend to help you with all that you do. In the yellow tissue paper are, are Crystal's gifts. There are two because after getting his head stuck in the wreath, the big stubborn one was afraid to come without his little buddy. They are both freestanding, the little one on his hind legs. Okay, so, um, so the card just explains explains the ornaments for Crystal. So we're going to open up Crystal's bag first because this is all about Crystal. This is not about me. By the way, if you guys want to send ornaments for Crystal, please don't send me any ornaments. I do not put up a Christmas tree and there's no need to send me any gifts either, but I do appreciate it. Oh my gosh. Okay. <clears throat> so this is for Crystal. <laughs> okay. I don't know. Can you guys see the little one? Oh my gosh. Okay, so I don't know if you're going to be able to see it, but here you go. It's like a little bunny. And then this is the donkey. Oh my 
my gosh, they're so cute. <gasps> Shut the front door. Are you serious? Those are just adorable. Okay, so let me see what she sent for me. Okay, so all wrapped up in this purple tissue paper. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Oh, it's a little doll. Look at the curly red hair. Oh my goodness. Oh, look, she's got angel wings and purple shoes. This is the sweetest thing ever. There's a little bag and it's got yarn in it. Oh my gosh. Oh, the bag just came off. Look at the little bag. Oh, stop it. Are you serious? Did you make this for me? Oh my gosh. Joy, that is amazing. You guys, that's not even like yarn. That's like thread, string. I don't know. That is something else. There's even a little crochet hook in the purple yarn. Oh my gosh. Okay. Thank you so much, Joy. You really did not have to do that. And I so appreciate it. So before I get to the next one, she did leave a car for, card for me. Joy did. And it says, the bag yarn and hook are removable to keep bag on shoulders. Make sure her arm is behind the bag. I did not put a hanger on her. Wasn't sure where to put it. Yarn fairy. It's a yarn fairy. Oh my gosh. I have a yarn fairy. Joy, you are so sweet for sending that. I really do appreciate it. Okay. So the next one, um, there is, uh, a note, it says for Crystal, so I'm gonna leave it um, sealed because I don't know if she wants me to open it up or not. Um, the next box is from New Jersey, and this is the ornament that was sent in from the person in New Jersey. There's no name on the box, but there is a card for me. So I'm gonna um, open up this card and see if there's a name so we know who sent this. Okay, she writes to me, I'm not gonna read the card for Crystal because it's a sealed envelope. She says, Dear Rose, thank you so much for collecting the ornaments to ship for Crystal. I really appreciate what you were doing. Love, Rose Marie. Okay, so Rose Marie, thank you so much. And Rose Marie sent this beautiful ornament for Crystal. Thank you so much, Rosemary. I do appreciate it. So the rest, I have a big box that's sitting here with all the envelopes in it. I did get another envelope from someone. It is Linda, just a crochet sister, and she did ask that I don't open her envelope on. So this will be going to Crystal. So Linda, just so you know, I have it and it, it will go to Crystal. Um, all right, so we're gonna get to the next package that's in the box. And this package comes from Doris, and she is from Rose Cottage Studio. Oh my goodness gracious. Okay, so it was bubble wrapped. I'll make sure I put it back in the bubble wrap, but the tin says crocheting forever. And there is a card and it is sealed with a heart and it says to Crystal, Eric and family. And then in the box, oh my gosh, there are, a, there are, it's like a whole family of snowmen hold on i'm gonna see how i can show these to you guys i'll probably have to show them one at a time or two at a time so there's a santa and a snowman oh my gosh there's two more santas so there's four santas oh my gosh there's these christmas trees oh how cute there's four christmas trees adorable and then there's, oh, so there's four of everything in here. Um, four of these, okay, so there's four of, they're all kind of stuck together in here. There's um, <laughs> four of the red snowmen and four of the green snowmen. And it was just sitting on the bottom of this, this red wrapped paper. So wow, thank you so much, Doris, for sending these adorable ornaments for Crystal and Eric and her family. I will make sure that they get the little tin and it's all wrapped up and ready to go. All right, let's get to the next item. So the next package comes from Great Britain and it's from Jane and she is in Sheffield and she sent this card for Crystal. And she writes, Rose, here is a Christmas ornament for Crystal at Bag O' Day. She deserves this little bit of appreciation of all the work she does on both her channels and for all her generosity. She is such a lovely person, as is all the family. Love from Jane from England. And she says, you may show my ornament and read my message if you want to. Yes, I want to. Okay, so my goodness, wait till you guys see this. <gasps> wow, Zah, that's big that's a big snowflake 
Oh my goodness, Jane, that is gorgeous. Thank you so much for sending that for Crystal. I will make sure that it stays protected when it goes to her in the big box. Okay, so the next envelope came from uh, someone in Maryland, and I do know their name, and Crystal will have their name, but they asked that we do not share their name on video. Um, but the card for me says, a holiday full of love, a season full of light, a world full of joy, a heart filled with peace. Wishing you the very best at this magical time of year. Um, you may read the card on video, but don't give out my name. So, and then she says, Merry Christmas to me. Thank you so much. And then this is the card for Crystal at Bago Day. And it says, um, um, Bago Day family, this special wish is just for you. And so is the love that's in it too. Have a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year with many Christmas wishes, Merry Christmas. And then it has their name in it, but I'm not going to read the name. And they have, there, there is a beautiful snowflake ornament in there. So thank you so much. You know who you are. The next little package came from Gail from New Hampshire and she wrote a note. Hi Rose, just a quick note, the enclosed ornament for Crystal at Bag o Day. Uh, year is a something, oh, yarn is Vanna's choice. Pattern was a YouTube tutorial and I can't remember the channel, but I'm pretty sure it's easy to find. Crocheted by me. P.S. Good luck from Gail. Okay, so she's got it in this little plastic bag. And um, it just has a tag on the back that says Vanna's Choice Yarn. And it's pretty thick. It's stapled together, so I'm going to leave it like that. So thank you so much, Gail. I'm going to make sure this gets back in the envelope and goes to Crystal. So the next package comes from Jax, and she has a YouTube channel here. It's called Creations by Jax. Hi, Jax. And she sent a note to, to me here first. Um, hi, Rose. Thank you for doing this ornament collection. The brown hats are, of course, the chocolate bonbon, and the blue is my unity beanie. Love, Jax. And then the note to Crystal. To Crystal, Eric, and fam, I hope you have many blessed years in your new home. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so <laughs> how cute is this? It is an ornament with hats. Oh my gosh, how cute is that? So these are all the chocolate bonbon beanies and this is her own creation for Hat Not Hate. <laughs> that is awesome. Thanks, Jax, for sending that for Crystal. I'll make sure it goes back in the box nicely. I do appreciate that. That's so cute. So the next bag or the next package came from Carol and she's from Arkansas and she put on the envelope, um, Rose at Rose Likes Crochet, read this first, okay? And then it says, hello, hello. <laughs> she writes, Rose, this is a great thing you are doing for Crystal. She is a wonderful, kind-hearted, loving, amazing woman. She deserves this and much more. Thank you, your YouTube fan, Carol. Okay, then there's a note for, for Crystal, and it's an open envelope, so I will show you guys. Have a goat day. <laughs> And she writes, um, Crystal, thank you for everything you do and teach on your YouTube channel. My mom has learned to crochet more than the basic stitches between you and one other YouTuber. So have I. I love using your tutorials. I have two baby nieces recently born and another almost here. So I'll be crocheting more of your dresses. Thank you again for everything. Hope you enjoy the or ornament. Your YouTube fan, Carol. Okay, and then this is the beautiful ornament. Oh my gosh, that is so, so pretty. Wow, Carol, thank you so much for sending that for Crystal. That is so, so nice of you. I do appreciate um, you guys all sending in stuff for Crystal. The next package came from Josephine from Arizona and she has this little card and it says, especially for you, Crystal, on it. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. And on the inside, it says, happy holidays, Crystal and family. You can hang on tree or stand on table from Joe. Okay, so here is the little angel. So there's the angel. So it's got the hanging thing and then it's got a little stand here. So you can take it, put it in the stand and set it on the table or you can hang it on the tree. That is so pretty. Thanks Joe for sending that to Crystal. All right, I'm gonna put this back in the padded envelope. <laughs> So the next package came from Rosalie from Pennsylvania and on the envelope it just said ornament for crystal and there was no note that I could find that there was a wrapped box that got pretty squished but that's okay because the ornament is just fine and here is the ornament that she sent oh my gosh it's so pretty look at that oh my goodness I don't even know how you would do something that tiny that's beautiful Wow, thank you so much, Rosalie, for sending that. I'm going to make sure it, it does not get crushed on the way back to Crystal. 
The next package came from Jan and she's from Michigan and she sent me a card and it says, hi Rose, okay to read. And there is the card. And she says, hey Crystal, this is such a fun idea. I know how much you love Christmas. Holiday blessings to you and your family in your new home from Jan. Okay, and then she sent this beautiful poinsettia. And there's also a card on the back that explains about the point, legend of the poinsettia. Reminds us that the miracle of the birth of baby Jesus belongs to all of God's children. The shape of the poinsettia flower and leaves are thought to resemble the star of Bethlehem, which led the wise men to Jesus in the manger. Every Christmas season, the poinsettia appears on top of green branches and is called the flower of the holy night. All right, so that's awesome. So there's a little bit of history there on the poinsettia. I will make sure that this all goes back in the envelope for Crystal, and thank you so much, Jan, for sending that. So the next envelope I actually got when I met up with um, Lynette from Charm Grammy Crochet. Hi, Lynette! And she gave me this envelope, and she asked me to give this to Crystal, and this is the card. Oh, and she writes, Crystal, I hope you and your family have the best Christmas ever in your new home. Merry Christmas from Lynette at Charm Grammy Crochet. So she made a little angel. Oh my gosh, that's beautiful. So thank you, Lynette. It was great to meet you. Um, and uh, hopefully we can do that again sometime. So I'll make sure Crystal gets this. So the next envelope comes from Christina and she's from South Carolina and she has an envelope in here but it is sealed so I'm going to leave it sealed but I am going to show you the beautiful ornament that she sent and I'll let Crystal open up the envelope. So that is gorgeous. Wow, Christina, thank you so much for sending that. I will make sure the card gets to Crystal too. So I did also get a package from Donna and Donna put on uh, the envelope, do not read on video or show, show the ornament. So I'm gonna just, um, just so you know, Donna, I did get your ornament and I'll make sure that Crystal gets that. So the next package came from Brenda from Nevada and she put a note in here. Hello Rose, I've made a bunch of these for my family and me. They look so pretty on a Christmas tree. Thanks and great idea to the person that thought of this. So exciting. I know Crystal will love it from Brenda. Check that out. Look at the little snow globe. How cute is that? adorable oh my goodness so for anyone who is just uh not sure what this is all about um if you guys want to send a christmas ornament for crystal at bag o day her christmas tree that's what this is that was what we're doing here and you can choose whether or not i read it on camera or not so the next package comes from jenny and she's from california and she actually has a youtube channel here i love her she she changed the name of her channel it used to be jenny's something. And now it's Jenny's Hobbies. I think it was Jenny's Jenny's Arts and Crafts. Now it's Jenny's Hobbies. Anyway, go check her out. She's super talented. She has an, a letter in here. Rose, here is a Christmas tree ornament for Crystal. I hope she enjoys it for many years. Thanks for doing this from Jenny. Okay, so this is the most cute, cutest penguin ever. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much, Jenny, for sending that for Crystal. That's adorable. So the next package came from Kay and she's from Michigan and she sent a note and it says, Hello, Crystal and family. I am so happy to be able to make a Christmas tree ornament for your huge tree that you are going to have. I started watching you a year ago. Before that, I couldn't make a thing. I love to listen to you talk and your yarn reviews are by far the best. You give so much to your yarny peeps. It's nice to give back to you. Have a very Merry Christmas. Stay safe. Sending good vibes from Michigan from Kay. Then she says, hello, Rose. Thank you for being the middle person for this awesome task you have took on. And thank you to the person who thought of this very good idea. Sending Merry Christmas wishes to everyone and sending good vibes from Michigan. Okay, so I'm going to leave it in the little, well, no, I'm going to take it out of the baggie so you guys can see it. It's a wreath and it's so pretty. It's got the little jingle bell in the center there. Oh my goodness, I love it. It's gorgeous. Thank you so much, Kay, for sending that. I will make sure that Crystal gets it. The next envelope I got came from Barbara and she's from Florida and she sent this card for Crystal. And it says, may the wonder and magic of the holidays fill you with delight. Best wishes for your first Christmas in your new home from Barbara. And then she sent this gorgeous angel. Can you guys see that? Holy smackerels. Oh my goodness gracious, that is absolutely gorgeous. Barbara, I will make sure that she gets it and it stays safe inside the envelope. So the next envelope comes from Dina and she's from Washington and she sent this card 
and it says rose thank you for sharing your kindness and joy enclosed is an ornament for crystal it's her newest hat tutorial the puff beanie posted on october 2nd merry christmas from dino oh my gosh oh my gosh crystal you are gonna love this when you see it in person holy carp Oh my God, that is the cutest thing ever that you made that so tiny. <laughs> that is awesome. Dina, I can't wait till Crystal gets that and sees that. She's going to love it. All right, we got two more packages. So the next envelope came from Dia Avila, and uh, they are not too far from us here in Illinois. So they're just a neighbor and just a note is the card. And it says, hi, Rose, I'm very excited to participate in the ornament making for Crystal. I wanted to make something unique and got the idea while watching Clark checking out his new yard. Please feel free to show my ornament and read this note as well as my first name. Thank you for all you do and for taking on this project. Oh, her name is Mercedes. Hi, Mercedes. And check out this adorable, adorable ornament. It is a paw print. And Clark is Crystal's dog. And could that be any cuter? I don't think so. Thank you so much, Mercedes, for sending that. I do appreciate it. I'll make sure that Crystal gets that. And we got one more, one more package, guys. So the next package comes from Shirley and Shirley is from Georgia and she sent this little snowman card and it just says on the inside, happy holidays from Shirley and she sent this adorable little snowman. Oh my goodness, how cute is that? So I wanna thank everyone who has sent in something for Crystal at Bago Day. I really do appreciate it. I think that she has done so much for our community and has helped us so much through our crochet careers. Um, that she definitely deserves to have uh, some stuff being done for her, right? So anyway, um, if you haven't sent in an ornament for Crystal, you can do it up until November 1st, and that's just so I can get everything packaged up and sent off to her so she can put it on her Christmas tree. So um, I think on one of her channel or one of her um, videos on her Bod Life channel, she did give out her, her P.O. box, but I don't know that it's listed in any description box. So feel free to send them to me. I'll make sure I do another video um with the last batch of Christmas ornaments that we get for her and this is just so exciting and so fun so thanks you guys for hanging out and uh, let me know if you have any questions have a great night bye